Now, is Kaylor and the Tower of Bone going to be up the stairs? There's been some fighting going on here. Corpses of Crusaders and Devils litter the stairs. Alright, guess we head up. This might be the last episode, depending on how far we have to go. This looks like a place where we could have a final battle. Definitely. A massive this door. This is so much better than my old life. I mean, Imkeen, we are literally in the Nine Hells right now. Could it really be that much worse with your old life? Let's see, an Imp, a Green Abishai, Black Abishai. Nothing really to worry about, but I'm going to use the range guys to take care of the Imp back there. I feel ah, like Imps might have um, charm spells, maybe. But that was rather easy. The Green Abishai gave us 8,000 XP, which is very appreciated. Give us some last minute boosts for the final battle, possibly. We have 100 in open locks and fine traps, so let's put that in Detect Illusion. All of it. Done. Did you get a new spell? You did? Level 3. I would like... Another Mist Cast Magic, maybe? Sure. Or Holy Smite might do really good in here. Because this is a 9 health. And level 4. Let's do a defensive harmony. Another one. Nothing on level 5. Also, didn't you get another spell? No, that was the last episode, and you already learned that. Sweet! Onwards! More corpses. So, Kaylor has been here. Come then, oh. you craven fiends! Come and meet your doom! Hey, Kaylor! Wanna team up? Kaylor! Kaylor, wait! Please! Talk to us! You promised to restore my wife, my children, yet all you've brought us is more death. I look in your eyes now and I see nothing but madness. You call me mad? I'll show you madness! I'll- No. No. You're losing it! I kill an innocent man. I've not fallen so far as that. But I cannot stop now. Do as you will. Join me or no, I care not. She's really blinded by Heffernan's betrayal. I mean, he was probably very important to her because he just popped up when she had given up on life, basically. And gave her purpose. And now, nothing. After her! She's our only hope to seal the portal! Your part in this is done. Now let me do mine! This has to end, Kalar! Come back to Dragonspear. We will seal the portal together. I cannot stop. There's no turning back for me. Not now. I swore an oath once long ago. I must keep it. Hmm, she is very stubborn. Did they lock the door behind them? They better not have. That would be super rude. Uh oh, is there a guardian here? Rex. Also, I g received a tip that I should probably put these on when we came here. Probably not. You have come like... far. Oh, is, is that something? The profane's master would have you go no further. For now. Who is this master you speak of? You will meet him yourself once he's done with the Argent. Assuming you survive that long, of course. Fellow fiends, attend Thrix. Tear this one apart, that he may see what it is made of. Alrighty then, Thrix, what are you? Are you Batisu or something like that? I should probably get ready with some buffing. And I should probably wear these for this fight. Your soft-hearted altruism. What do we have here? Abishai Bonefiend Erinius. Erinius is are pretty uh, bad because they have charm spells. I probably want to uh, focus on you. I've equipped all of my best ammo right now because it's no use keeping them. For the last battle. So that takes care of that one. You might want to use an absorb health, because why the heck not? Get you some healing! Now the Bone Fiend might be My our biggest friend. Or not! 
You fight well. Thrix the Profane is impressed. So Thrix is the servant of someone. But the Profane? That sounds like a title of one of those people in the meeting. Thrix's master bid him bar all but the Argent for a time. And Thrix would not want to disappoint his master. Unless... If Thrix believed his master would not be his master much longer, if he believed you might slay his master, then Thrix might allow you passage. Master has been most vexing since the business with Kren Shinnabon. Thrix is weary. Kren Shinnabon? Oh, that's from the, um, Drizdurden Icewind Dale trilogy, if I remember correctly. Now... I am a paladin. I should probably not be making deals with dev devils right here. I mean, this is not really a deal. It's more like an ultimatum. If Thrix really wanted his master to fall, Thrix might offer more assistance than merely standing aside. You are in the first and greatest of the hells, little thing. Nothing here comes free. But perhaps you might be interested in a wager. Thrix has three items that might be of use to one who would storm the Basalt Tower. This blade, sharper than the loudest shriek. This helm that cradles the head more softly than a mother does her newborn babe. This staff is gnarled and ugly, all but useless. But if you win my bet, it is one of the others. It or one of the others would be yours. And if I lose? Thrix will take one of your friends. You ask me to risk a friend to a devil's game? No. We'll do this, but my soul, not one of theirs, will be the prize. You willingly gamble your own soul. Oh, Thrix likes you. And he agrees. You'll make a fine addition to his collection. And now, the riddle. You should like this, child of Baal. Thrix's riddle was devised for you, and you alone. Now, tell me what I speak of. A useful tool, though most despise it. In light, it can topple kingdoms. In shadows, it sustains nations. Paupers fear it daily. Kings fear it deeply. You were born to serve it, but because of it, you will die. What is it? Hmm. Hmm. You speak of murder, devil. You have answered my riddle. Aren't you clever? Clever, clever, ball spawn. Now choose your prize. Now, he did say the sword was very powerful, but it might be cursed. I'm very curious about this so-called useless staff. But... Let's try the sword. An excellent choice. You won't regret it. Thrix's master should be finished with the Shining Lady by now. Enter freely, and of your own will. There we go. It appears to be a longsword, which is great for us. Tongue of Acid plus three. 10% chance per hit of slowing the target for three rounds. That's pretty damn good. I'm going to wear that. And it's not cursed, which is great. Maybe get rid of the Burning Earth, because this is pretty useless. Unless there's going to be undead in the final battle. I mean, we can just swap while we're here anyway. And now, let's get the spectacles on, see if we can find anything. Is there anything out here? Now, if you remember, the spectacles can be used to find things from other planes and pull them in here. So we can interact with them. Doesn't appear to be anything there. Maybe it's up ahead. We have our final charge saved up for this, whatever it is. You must gather your party before venturing forth. The screams of the damned are muted within the basalt tower, but a maggot stench of the place nearly overwhelms you. With every breath, it slithers into your body, its barbed tendrils raking your lungs. Oh, hello! Are you the one? Yeah, through the spectacle spectacle, you catch sight of an otherworldly creature. 
Let's this see what happens. So much better than my old life. Item drained? What? I've definitely just used it two times. What the hell is this? What? That's weird. Very weird. Shit. Well, I guess we can't use it. Weird ass demon, you gotta stay where you are. On we go! In the center of the basalt tower, an iron lattice hangs over a shadowy abyss. Four massive chains at the corner of the grate lead upward Everyone into the alert. darkness, above as ominous or more so than the one below. Damn it, Corwin, why did you have to speak when I was reading? This tower will crumble beneath the might of Ilkhan! Assuming we ever escape this infernal shaft! Let's try to get everyone at max health by using these- Oh, hello! We got company! An imp and a lemure. That should be fine. Feel the no pain. threat to us, I think. But while we're at it, does someone have the uh, mass healing? Didn't I learn it on you? Recall spirit! Oh, so she gets a, uh, a resurrect as well. I guess we'll keep pumping these. Do you have any... I mean, you have 15 of these, so might as well use that. I want everyone on full health for what's to come. So keep drinking. Your soft-hearted altruism is going to get us all killed. Are we there yet? Come on, come on! Cloak shadows, cloak shadow. I am oh. so bored. Ow! That really hurts. Oh. Come on, Nira, don't die on me now. I think I'll drink this. Why not? She doesn't really need too much. Because of her low HP. But I would like to give her one or two of these. Just in case. And Dorn needs another one of these. Floor's moving. Floor shouldn't move. I mean, I'm pretty sure I'm keen that we are the one who's who are moving on this elevator. Hmm. I wonder if there's going to be an opportunity to arrest. Let's get everyone situated so we can protect our weakest ones. Yeah, that's good. Now these guys, ah, I think it's the red true. ones, have a um, fear aura. We read about that in this book, if you remember. Like, powerful fiends... no, that's not it. The most powerful of fiends constantly radiate an aura of fear. So that's what happened to Amkeen. And Dorn got charmed temporarily. Take care of that, Amkeen. Thank you. Who's next? Can I rest here? No. Would be kind of or kind of weird if I could. Who's next? Anyone? I mean, this is a lovely place. I mean, this really reminds me of the uh, intro scene in the Super Mario RPG, one of my favorite SNES games. I might do a live stream on that sometime in the summer. Might have some time then. I recently bought a uh, PS4 controller, which is awesome. For emulators and such things. Oh, here we go. Oh, is that Heffernaz Master? We should probably help the Crusaders. You know what I want, Belafet. Release him! It's your... You make a mockery of your lover. uncle's sacrifice in coming here, your uncle. Asimar. But I will grant you your desire. After a fashion. Oh, they're losing! Why are you just standing there, Court and everyone? It's just you and me now. You and On will be together again. Your cage will hang next to his. Ah, the child of Baal. 
Welcome. Welcome. You're just in time to witness the fall of Kalar Argent. What is going on here, Kalar? Damn you, Heffernan! It was your treachery that brought me to this. My treachery and your arrogance, shining lady. This is the secret of Kalar's crusade. There is only one soul in Avernus Kalar has ever cared for. Her uncle on Argent. A man who sacrificed all to save her. Is this true, Kalar? No. No. If I could have freed the Dragon Spear dead, I would have. But you could not. No one could. And in your heart of hearts, you knew that. So long I was trapped here, unable to reach the material plane. And then this child walked willingly, blindly, into my domain. No mere mortal, either, but an Azimar, and an Argent, and mine. All mine. I know not what lies brought Kalor here, Belifet, and I care not. The fiend behind the crusade stands revealed, and you will pay for the Sword Coast's suffering. You dare challenge the great Belifet here in his place of power! I'll not do it alone. Kalor, join me! Let Belifet's death be the first stepping stone on your path to redemption. After everything I've done, you would have me at your side? I mean, you are a uh, Asimar. So be it. The Child of Baal and the Shining Lady will stand together against this devil's darkness. You are as arrogant as my mistress, and you will share her fate. We'll see about that. Now, this guy's probably gonna be very powerful, but I am very concerned about Heffernan's spell casting. We have the Chaotic Command, so we can get at least Card, maybe, or Dorn. Immune to uh, charms and such, which could be very handy. Meanwhile, I would like you to try to cast some Insect Plague. Hopefully that will spread to Heffernan. I would like you to summon some monsters. And I would like you to attack Heffernan with the Arrows of Biting, maybe. Or maybe have the Arrows of Dispelling ready. We do have the Arrows plus three as well. We might want to have those at the ready. We'll start off with the Arrows of Biting. Oh! Heffernan is a demon as well! That I was not prepared for. Let's see if we can do anything about the fear. Doesn't appear like it. Are you casting your thingy? Oh, it's coming right there. Next up, I would like you to... Uh, what is Spirit... What, what is Spirit Fire? Level 4. Summoning. Also, it's basically like... Um, near us. Um, those balls of fire. I will uh, take some of that. Use it. On... Oh, so it's a fireball type thing. Maybe put it right there then? And Nira, I would like you to follow up with... Are you buffed up? No, you are not. So I think we're good. Maybe follow up with Melt's Minute Meteors. What is that? Ability score drained. Dexterity and Charisma. I would like you to drink the Storm Giant Strength. Buff your strength up as much as you can, and f go on Heffernan. Nice, they're all uh, in... Oh shit, oh shit, what was that? What is that? That is really damaging. But Heffernan appears to be dead. That is awesome. Or is he? This isn't working. We have to try something else. We have to try healing Dorn. Wait, did we do it? Did he go invisible or something? Oh, he uh, teleported, that son of a bitch. Get out of the fire, everyone. You need to heal up with a potion. Come on, Glint. Oh, he's got some sort of invisibility, but my insect plague is taking care of it. 
Down goes one of my hobgoblins, or whatever that was. Cart appears to be stunned. And Dorn as well. Can we do something about that? Will Spiritual Clarity help with that? I'd like to get Cart back first. If at all possible. Glint! If you can get a miscast magic on him... I'm not sure he does a lot of magic, but... Oh, he's invisible. Never mind then. I would like you to swap to your plus three bullets and attack. I would like Nira to use her spells to... Uh, hmm, breach her secret word. I mean, he's probably uh, still... Ooh, 50? Jesus Christ, I know I bought it straight from the vendor, but 50 charges? Some of the more beasts. Ow. That kind of hurts. He's going down, slowly but surely. I would like you to swap to an arrow dispelling. Maybe get that um, invisibility of his off. Arrow anti magic. No, that won't help us. Did I get it off? No, I did not. And Glint might be in trouble. Ow! Oh, ow! No. Move out of that right now. Near is feared. Is anyone still in the thing? Damn it. He's near death, though. If you guys can finish him off, the uh, th uh, spot of fire is not that much of an issue. This isn't working. We have to try something else. Yeah, I would like you to try your plus three arrows. Ha! My aim is true. That should be enough. I'll recover. Ow! That really hurts. Take care of Nira. Quickly. You guys are still stunned, but you guys are wrecking house. Oh, he's back again. Or gone again, rather. Killer is tanking. That's good. But Nira is in big trouble. She's gonna die. Oh. She's stunned. Do I have a dispel ready? Can I get the dispel on the stuns? I really would like that. After all yes. this time, this cannot be the end. This cannot be. We did it! Awesome! Killer? I can scarcely believe it. Everything I did, every sacrifice I made, all to reach this moment. You are free at last, uncle. I know not what you did to make this happen, Kayla. Whatever it was, the cost was too great. Tell him, Kayla. Tell him the price the Sword Coast bore that he might be freed from Belifet's clutches. A heavy toll was paid by me and those who followed me. A heavier one still was exacted from those who stood in my path. Am I without regret? No. Would I do it again? Without hesitation. And you have learned nothing. Retribution is all that is left. You will return to the material plane, close the portal to Avernus, and stand trial for your crimes. I am an Argent. I hold myself to the highest standard. I know I did evil, though I did it in pursuit of good. I must answer for my crimes. Or are you gonna do some sort of magical sacrifice? Divine blood was the key to opening Dragonspear's portal to Avernus. The blood of a powerful devil will lock it once again. Here, take this key. It will open the Dragon Spear Vault. I'll not be returning to Toril. What? No, Kayla. I'll not allow it. You'd remain in this accursed place rather than face the Sword Coast's justice, Kalar. You fear the Council of Four and the Lords of Waterdeep more than you do the denizens of Avernus? I mean, I see where she's coming from. She wants to, like, stay here and wage war against the Devils as atonement. And if she returned, the other members of the crusade, the remaining members, might see her as a uh, martyr. 
The portal can only be closed from this side. Someone must remain behind. I shall sever Avernus's connection to Toril, and then stand guard. Whosoever would cross the threshold to Dragonspear will first face Kalar Argent. I can do nothing to change the past. What future I have is here, in this place. That was true from the moment I first summoned Belafet. Uncle, please, go now, before Avernus's legions overtake us. Do what you can to redeem the Argent name of the shame I brought upon it, I beg you. I... May Lathander's light shine upon you, child. It's silver cards. Let's go. One by one, they leave the Nine Hells. Somehow, Corwin while still being stunned. I suppose that's a fitting end to Keller Argent. Standing guard for all times. It's done. Thank the gods. The portal is closed. Let's get that vault door open. I would speak with Torsen Delancey about his decision to lock me in. I went to Avernus and came back. I really did. And nobody who wasn't here will ever- Hellhole's closed. That's good. Still trapped though. That's not so good. You should stop interrupting each other, guys. We so would- many secrets lie buried God beneath damn it. the ground. That is not the time. The Kate is Zeal and Kalar. She has done what she must. It is strange to be in the world again. I must put my life back together. A team like this can't be beat. Wait, who's Darnus? Oh, th it's one of the uh, surviving crusaders? I will do what I can, Dragon. All right, then. Let's see what Delancey has to say. Is he gonna, like, try to, uh, blame things on us or something? Because we still don't have, like, an answer to, uh, why we are going to be driven out of Bulge Gate. Hold your fire! Everyone, hold your fire! It's good to see you. What happened? The portal to Avernus is closed. And what of our shining lady? Tours in the lands of Waterdeep, let me introduce you to On Ar Argent, Knight of the Order of the Aster. I'll let him tell you what happened to Kalar. It is an honor to make your acquaintance, Master Argent. I wish it were under different circumstances. If there is anything I can do for you, please don't hesitate to let me know. Our forces are sweeping the castle now. Checking for traps or pockets of resistance. The surviving crusaders have either fled or surrendered. The siege is ended, as is the threat of the Nine Hells. I believe the time has come to celebrate. Yay! Party! <laughs> Betting in the castle will be set up for you and other worthies who prove themselves in battle. When you've finished celebrating down here, speak with Sergeant Dazzo. You'll find him on the stairs up to the main floor. He'll take care of you. Is that all you've got for the savior of Dragonspear? You can do better than that. Three cheers for the hero of Baldur's Gate. Thank you, thank you. I am honored. I'll admit I had my doubts about you, Karts. But you proved yourself more than a worthy as an ally. I'm honored to have fought beside you. Now if you'll excuse me, I need to go check on Sky or Ski. With Kaylor defeated, there will likely be some revelry, and she can be overly celebratory if you grasp my meaning. What does he mean? He probably means We're getting close. something will all be over soon. nice. I don't think I've seen you smile like that before, Shale. You should do it more op often. Come here. I want to kiss you. And I want to let you. I'll take your words over roses any day. I'm almost there, Roma. I'll be home soon. Not l nearly soon enough, but at least we're alive to make the trip. That's no small thing, considering. Come back to Baldur's Gate with me. I'll smile a lot more once I see my daughter again. 
That sounds like an invitation. There's a reason for that. Come here. Let me give you a taste of what it's an invitation to. Back to the city then, as soon as we can. In the meantime, let's go find some place a little more private. Bow chicka wow wow. So do we just rest down here? Oh, Viconia, are you alright? Thaug, you survived. <sighs> Look at this. The bloody hero of Baldur's Gate honors us with his presence. We all contributed to this afternoon's victory, Dwergar. Not all of us will be so celebrated as you, oh hero. You think the sheep herders and the turnip pickers be singing Thaug's praises? You're mad, human. But you did w good work here with the Shining Witch, and there's no doubting it. Now be on your way, I. I want to finish up here before that literal rock picker Belagarm tries to say what plunder here is to be had in it's the fistus now. Aw, Safana. And so another woman of strength is laid low by the entrenched power of the Sword Coast elites. I'd be sad if the witch hadn't had it coming. Alright then. Yes, yes, you dealt with Kaelor Argent. Good work. What more do you want? Perhaps a pat on the head? Would that make you happy? You bastard, Edwin. You bastard. A fine finish for a fearsome foe. And a far hard fought fame found for the hero Baldur's Gate. A more con Dying conclusion I couldn't concoct. You and your words. There was but one way this could end. All light will falter in the Olaf of Shar. Alright then. Do you like me now, Belgarm? I have many fine wares. Oi there! Good work with Kaelor and the portal and, you know, the helds and whatnot. The fist couldn't have defeated the crusade without you. Ah. I guess you like me now. That's good. That's real good. Is there any more loot in here? Probably not, right? No. Now, who do I want to talk to for going to rest? If I did that. Andres! Or for the duck deep. Dug deep. Look at this cart. Look at it lying there, just, just glowing. What a waste. Oh, it's your... Some sort of gooey substance. Doja! You are more than welcome in my sight. Could I have a moment to describe the countless ecstasies to be found suffering in the ill matter's name? No? Another time then. Alright then, I'll keep that in mind, Doja. I'm impressed. When I learned it was you in the vault, I wasn't certain you would be equal to the task. I'm rarely so pleased to be wrong. Rude! Also kinda... Flattering. Oh, hey guys! Oh, tis the hero of Baldur's Gate. Or perhaps a new sobriquet is in order. Liberator of Dragonspear, Bane of the Shining Lady. I am happy to be known simply by my name. Sometimes it is necessary to take up arms for the greater good. But humility is the true mark of a hero. This hero could learn a thing or two about being a hero. <laughs> Leave it to Volkin. One night, and let us say, three casks of ale, and I will have found the words to match your deeds. Your tale will be told alongside those of the great heroes of old. Take some time to savor our victory. You earned it. My companions and I will continue working to root out any further pockets of resistance that may remain in the castle or around it. Fare thee well. Fare thee well, Rafus. Jahira, did you get the gift from Khalid? First Saravok, now Kaelor Argent. Do you not think your actions have gone unnoticed or unappreciated? I mean, you are technically uh, supposed to be true neutral. So we are doing a bit too much good in your... Well, how you should be thinking. But she's basically like a uh, renegade druid. She's more like a uh, chaotic good type of person. I was not pleased with how you handled things at Bridgefort, but in the end, the greater good was served. I shall let bygones be bygones. Aww. It is our names the Skald will praise in the days and years to come, but had Kaelor been victorious, things would have been different. Ah, Vogel is no fan of thinking. 
Certainly not when there's drinking to be done. Ho ho! If you see a wineskin, be sure to send it mine way, yeah? In here? I have been too long chasing shadows. I must refocus my attention on the task my sisters assigned me. Swell? Do you know where I might find a cobbler? The toes in my boots are worn through from all the, well, you know. The ass kicking of goodness! El for goodness! Did I just say Eller? Or! I, I meant to say or! Accidental Swedish. Kaylor's Fred is eliminated, but I fear I am no closer to finding the one I seek. Still, Salune puts me on the path. I must follow it wherever it takes me. I feel like it's gonna take you to Baltigate 2 in all edition, which you should definitely check out in the uh, description below for a full play playthrough of that. Anyone else I want to talk to? You? Any named persons? No. So someone was waiting for me up at the stairs, right? Someone I wanted to talk to when I was done here? Sergeant Dazzo! Still we wait. Well met. I am Dazzo of Waterdeep, and if I may say, it has been an honor to fight alongside the former hero Baldur's Gates. What do you mean, former hero? What do you... what do you mean? Baldur's Gate can no longer claim you for its own. You represent more than a city. You are a champion of the Sword Coast in all the realms. You do me greater honor than I deserve, but I thank you all the same. Now if you'll excuse me, I require some rest. Enjoy the respite while you can, my lord. You can never be sure how long things will stay calm these days. <laughs> 